each other. TikTok, meet YouTube. YouTube, meet TikTok. I'm sure you guys uh, have met each other before. It's been a long time. I think you guys should become closer friends. So I'm here to bring you two together. So I'm here live on two different things. Number one, because I was very interested what the YouTube live was really about. Like I was kind of just interested to see what it was. And number one fun fact that I found about YouTube is you can go live publicly, which is what I'm doing now, or you can go live with just sharing the link to people. So I'm like, hmm, ideas, ideas, ideas. So I can just share a link to a handful of people and then use YouTube live in order to do that live. I love it. I love it. Hello from Louisiana over here in TikTok land. So for my TikTokers over here, you lovely, lovely individuals looking very good over here, by the way, YouTube, these TikTokers are looking very sexy today. My name is Laura Marie Massey with underscores, Laura underscore Marie underscore Massey. That's TikTok. TikTok, my YouTube, it's just my name, Laura Marie Massey. There we go. I make it nice and simple, nice and simple. So I most recently made a YouTube video. I had a lot of fun doing it and I want to do more of them. I really do. And I will be absolutely so excited about it. So it was all about my most recent YouTube video was all about motivation. What the hell is it? How do you cultivate it? It is a very, it's a very mm, questionable thing. You don't really know what it is. You don't know when it's going to come. You don't know when it's going to leave, blah, blah, blah. So how the hell do you get motivation? Where does it come from? So I did a whole YouTube video just on that. I had a lot of fun doing it. It's kind of, you know, just like a day in the life almost, because honestly, we're not always motivated. Motivation is not going to be there all the time. Someone says bicep flex. Someone asked me for, I don't always do that when it is said when I go live, whether it be TikTok or Instagram or anything like that. But hey, I did just hit arms the other day, so I'm feeling pretty good about it. Anyways, so motivation really is just about helping create energy for yourself. There's no way you're going to be able to figure out what to be motivated on if you are exhausted or if you don't have energy. So how do you create energy? Boom. But if you're questioning what you want to be motivated on or towards, that's a whole nother YouTube video. That's a whole nother YouTube video, which I had a great conversation about with a good friend of mine. You know, it's like you, you find yourself being stressed out. You know, it's like there's stress. What do I focus on? What do I do? I'm, I like, uh, whether that stress feels good to you or not, some people thrive in stress or stressful environments, stressful feelings. So if you're questioning, what do I do? Like, what is it that fulfills me? You know, like my job is stressful. Okay, I get it. Your job is stressful. So what a lot of people go home and they drink alcohol or they smoke, or, you know, and it's just to stay sane. Somebody on Instagram live said that to me. I only, I don't drink alcohol at all, not at all. And this individual said, I drink alcohol like once a month and it's just to keep myself sane, just for sanity purposes. So I'm like, let's, let's see, what else can we be doing in our lives that's gonna keep us sane? Like what's gonna keep us sane? And it's really about enjoying the process of things enjoying the process. So everybody has to work to make money. We got to make money. We have to live. You know, we need to pay for a shelter. We need to pay for food. You know, this coconut water, which I love. Hashtag not an ad. Mm -hmm. So we got to do that. So how do we enjoy the process of all the shit that we have to do? What is it? You know, it's like, what do you want? What do you have to do? Blah, 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 all that shit. I really think that I would love to do a YouTube video on that. 
because a lot of people end up choosing to do things in order to avoid discomfort. And then what happens is, is that they end up doing things that feel easier. They end up doing things that feel easier instead of doing what they really think is going to fulfill them because they want to avoid discomfort, you know? So it, it's, it's so questionable. It's so questionable about where to take things. You have to thrive in those situations. You have to understand that you, you, you need to go towards what fulfills you and not be nervous about the stress that's going to come. You have to understand that you are going to be able to overcome that stress for sure. For sure. Someone's asking me over here, do I like coffee? Absolutely, Chet. I love coffee. <laughs> I love going live. I'm going live on two different platforms right now. I'm focusing here on TikTok and somebody here on TikTok said, hey, you better give me eye contact or I'm about to leave. <laughs> sir, yes, sir. I mean, ma'am, yes, ma'am. I'm not sure. Not quite sure which one, but I love it. Love it. So I just wanted to hear from you guys what possibly you could actually take the time to watch an entire YouTube video on. I went live on Instagram the other day and ended up writing a few uh, a few topics down that people were really asking me about. And the main things were, how do I stay on top of things? Like if I wanna start eating clean and eat healthy, how do I continue to do that? So how do you continue to eat healthy? That could be one thing. You know, there's a lot of tips and tricks. It takes a while to get through this mindset, you know, because we, we get used to eating certain things and we love it. We love eating yummy foods. I ate Oreos, double stuffed Oreos all day, every day, you know, and now I'm eating clean and I actually enjoy it and I actually love it. So I could do a whole video on that. A lot of people asked me also on Instagram live yesterday, was it yesterday or the day before? they asked me cardio everybody wants to know about cardio so a lot of the questions end up coming down to like how do you get lean how do you stay lean and the reason why when i came on here first and i was really talking about stress is because that hinders a lot of people from continuing to do the things that they really say they want to do so it's very interesting. It's very interesting where things can go and how far you can take them. And I believe in you, I really do. So YouTube, I hope to get some really good answers from TikTok over here about my next YouTube video. If you haven't already, please watch my most recent YouTube video. I had a lot of fun making it. Um, it took some time. I do all of my own content creation and editing and stuff. So thank you for the support on watching that. YouTube, I will see you guys very soon. Okay.